The Sirinumu Dam, which was officially opened in 1963, provides water for consumption and electricity for Port Mosby. The dam is the only water source for the country's capital city and its half a million inhabitants. Earlier this month, on the 2nd of October, when MTV visited the dam, the levels were at 139 million cubic meters. When we return today, the levels were at 129 million cubic meters. That's a drop of 10 million cubic meters in a span of three weeks. We have, uh, this morning we have around 129.34 million cubic meter from the last time 139, which is about 10 million cubic meter drop. On the other hand, PPL Water Management Officer Laon Medako said the current levels are slightly better than the El Nino situation faced in 1997. With the prolonged dry spell experienced throughout the country, PNG Powers Water Management says it has put in place control mechanisms to ensure its consumers in the nation's capital are protected. And we're not uh, panicking because the way we manage and control the, the flow here is, is slowly dropping. Uh, we had a bit of rain this morning, 18.6 million millimeter, and uh, we should be all right until the end of the year. It was revealed in a statement that senior executives of Edaranu and PNG Power met to discuss contingency plans and strategies to counter the El Nino period. PNG Power acting CEO and chief operating officer John Yanis has given his undertaking that once water levels at the Sirinomu Dam drop to the 100 cubic meter mark, all hydroelectricity generation using this source will cease. Water level at Sirinomu is now at 38% dam capacity level and with a monthly drawdown rate of 5% by both SOEs, this water is expected to last another 8 to 10 months. Edarano Chief Executive Officer Henry Mokono is strongly appealing to residents of NCD, especially the settlements and Motukoita villages, to be water-wise. Deli Waigeno, National MTV News.